are going to look at how to uh, respond to the error that you would get when trying to uh, erase an external drive. Um, you know, you, you want to make it APFS, and you know, this happens to be a, a SanDisk, so I'm going to call it a San Apple, uh, not to be confused with Snapple, the, the drink. But we're going to hit erase, and you're going to see the chosen size is not valid for the chosen file system. And it gives you some sort of an error code here, right? And it just tells you that the operation has failed and it's, it's just not working, right? So you're probably just like, oh, well, well what can I do here? You know, I'm having issues. Um, you know, so maybe your first instinct is to go into run, run uh, first aid, and try to repair it. That all happens and everything. And you're just like, wow, wonderful. You know, now, now maybe I can do something. Nope. The answer is no, you, you cannot. What you need to do is you actually need to uh, click this icon up here for view and then hit show all devices rather than only uh, show volumes. And now what you're going to see is you will be able to click onto the, um, the, the actual, <clears throat> the, the parent device, right? So ESP is a, a volume here um, and, and MS-DOS uh, or, or FAT12 uh, physical volume on that USB external drive, whereas this actually is the entirety of it, right, with, with your whole entire uh, partition map and such. So what we're going to do is go ahead and just right click on, on the parent um, device and hit erase. From here, you'll be able, be able to you know, change this to APFS. Uh, and then for the scheme, um, you know, you, you can make it either a, a GUID or, or MBR a device. I personally am going to go with the Apple partition map. Um, and what you could do is, is do um, Mac OS extended. Um, short of that, if you wanted to, um, you could go with uh, GUID and do APFS. Uh, really doesn't matter a whole lot. Um, I, I believe that the difference between Mac OS extended and the uh, APFS is not uh, much different i could be wrong though so uh, do your own research on that you know go go search up what the apple partition map is uh, in comparison to the the guid uh, partition map and now when i hit erase on this um, it, it's going to go ahead and format that to um you know to the apfs right and then now that that's erased and done um and we now have that a disk to use and here we go you know we, we have all this free space and we can go ahead and use it